think you're exaggerating. All hail Mackenzie Falls to me, Chad Dylan Cooper. Huzzah! We're on a fake date. We have to make it look believable. Well, if you want to hold hands, you got to switch sides. Why? This is my holding hand. Well, at least my show brings joy to our viewers. <laughs> at least my show has viewers. And just so you know, this is our first and last fake date. Good. Good. Now smile like you're having the time of your life. <laughs> This way. Put your arm around me. Well, I would, but you sat on the wrong side. <laughs> this arm says let's cuddle, and this arm says it again, bro. Chad, you are so superficial. Yeah, all I hear from that is, Chad, you are so super blah, 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 blah. Baby's here. Really, Chad? Honey? Oh, man, answered the wrong phone. Look, I need a favor. I have the sweetest girl here, and she really wants to meet you. Ooh, that's what she look like. She's nine. <laughs> Back in action. <laughs> CDC, what to do? Look, we have the sweetest little girl in the world here, and she really wants to meet you. Man, I gotta get a third phone. <laughs> Come on, Chad. She really, really wants to meet you. She's a huge fan. Yeah, of course she does. Okay, but unlike you, we're very busy at Mackenzie Falls, so besides, I'm. <laughs> Tunnel. Why are your needs always more important than mine? Look, your friends got into this hot new club called The Basement. You've got to get me in there. Oh, so you need something from me, huh? Where's this going? I'll get you into The Basement. Awesome. If? This is why I have two phones. You take that little girl from the charity with you. Actually, funny little story. She's not actually from a charity. She's... Sonny, I don't care about the girl or the charity or your funny little stories that seem to never be funny or little. <laughs> funny. No, we were shooting a scene. No, it's hard to believe I could look this good when I look this bad, huh? <laughs> Normally that would have charmed you. What's up with you? Hey, Chad, sorry, I can't talk. I'm in a hurry. Oh, right, right. That's secret prom. <laughs> you know, not much of a secret when every kid in the lot's walking around with flyers that read... Secret prom. <laughs> Little girl I'm obligated to hang with. <laughs> Why would you write yourself a fan letter? <sighs> because I lost faith in myself. Huh. Classic case of actor insecurity. Started doubting your abilities, wondering whether you were good enough and whether you deserved to be on TV. So you've been through this? No. No. No, but I made you think I had, which is why I'll never go through it. Sweetie, all my leading ladies fall in love with me. Go ask Tisdale. Or Hudgens. Or yourself by week's end. Hell, that mine is a bargain, you know. Just gonna have to settle for me. I'm casting a TV movie about my life. Chad Dylan Cooper? The Chad Dylan Cooper story, a Chad Dylan Cooper production. That was some kiss. What do you mean? That kiss was fake. It was not. Chad, I put my hand over your mouth. Well, that explains why your lips tasted like skee ball and air hockey. <sighs> do you actually think I would really kiss you? That's what I'm gonna put on my blog. 